Good morning, YouTube. Thanks for coming to my channel. My name is One of Kyle Vlogs. If you're new to the channel, like, subscribe, then on post notifications so you never miss a video. Comment down below. Now, today I'm going to do Cancer Stage 3. And it goes as follows Being told you or your loved one has stage 3 cancer can be frightening. Frightening. Stage 3 cancers are more advanced, which means tumors are larger and may have spread farther than stage one and two still there are there are effective treatments for many stage three cancers uh, understanding stages cancer stages called the tnm scale is vital staging affects sur survival rate treatment options and potential of readmission the period with few cancer symptoms Symptoms. On the TMN scale, stage 3 cancer is pretty advanced. The tumor has usually grown large and disease tissue can be found in other organs. It is also called locally advanced cancer. So original seven. Treatment for stage 3 cancer varies according to which organ it affected. Most are harder to treat than stage one or stage two. The prognosis or outlook for stage three cancer depends on many factors. Where the cancer is, how it reacts to treatment, your health, your age, can also affect the chances of recovery. Stage three cancers require expert care and likely a lot of it, though some stage three cancers can be cured. They, can, they are more likely to come back after going away. Doctors use cancer spaces to compare patients with similar diagnosis. It helps them to study the how effect treatment are to track the growth of the cancer and estimate survival rate for, this, for different cancers. Okay. Definition. When doctors access a cancer stage, they use a system developed by American Joint Committee on Cancer. It has three parts and is called the TNM system. The letters and numbers differ from cancer. Excuse me, from cancer to cancer. They have the same structure. T defines the tumor in itself. Doctors analyze its size and how far it has spread into the surrounding tissues and organs. The T rating ranges from 0 to 4. The bigger the tumor and the more it has spread, the worse the patient prognosis is likely to be. N describes the intent of lymph node involvement and the number of lymph nodes in the area of the tumor. Lymph nodes can are glands that are, are glands in your immune system. A tumor's end value value varies from zero to three, depending on how far it has spread. M stands for metastasis. That's a spread of cancer cells to other or organs. They are only two M stages, zero to one. For no or yes, respectively, it is harder to treat cancer that has spread. Now, these are not all cancer use the TNM system for stage. Gen Colologic, second time, G-Y-N-E-C-O-L. OGIC cancer. Use TMO and the FIG system for the International Federation of that word. Anyway, cancers of the brain and certain nervous systems don't have a formal staging system. They rarely spread beyond these organs. I don't know what it is. I'm tired today for some reason. 
on those other organs. Small cell lung cancers are limited or extensive based on how far they spread. Blood cancers use the RAI Lugano or Bennett staging system. Recap. The N TNM system assigns a stage of two cancer based on the size of the tumor. How many lymph nodes are involved and whether it has spread to other organs. Not all cancers are staged. Using the TNM system, some use other systems and some aren't staged at all. Stage 3 Diagnose Criteria We tend to talk about all three all stage three cancers as if they are the same. In reality, those diagnoses differ widely based on cancer type. A stage three cancer often has one or more three features. The tumor has grown beyond a certain size, unusual measures in centimeters. It has spread to a set of nearby lymph nodes such as the axillary lymph node and breast cancer. It is thin to into nearby structures, for example, the chest wall and breast cancer. Some stage three cancers are subdivided to classify them more precisely. These substations differ based on which organ is involved. For example, stage three breast cancer has three subcategories. 3A. The tumor is smaller than 5 centimeters but has spread to 4 to 9 nodes. The tumor is larger than 5 centimeters and has spread to 1 to 9 nodes. Let know. 3B. The tumor is any size but has invaded the chest wall or breast tissue. It is swollen, inflamed, or has ulcers. It may have also invaded up to nine near, nearby lymph nodes. 3C, the tumor is any size. It has spread to 10 or more lymph nodes, lymph nodes near the collarbone or lymph nodes near the underarm or breast bone. Hmm. Other factors. Okay, there are a few other things that help doctors determine cancer stage cell type. Even when cancers appear in the same organ, they might act differently based on what kind of cell turn cancerous. Each of other organs has many types of cells, any of which could become cancerous. The cell type can affect how cancer acts and, re and react to treatment. For example, cancer from the mucus Producing gland cells react to treatment different than cancer in the lining of the esophagus. Tumor location. Where is the organ the tumor is found can affect the cancer stage? For example, the esophagus cancer stage and partially spread depends on which part of the esophagus has cancer. Tumor blood markers. For certain cancers, doctors can test the blood for certain circular materials, usually, usually it's protein. These markers can help them decide on the stage. For example, prostate, prostate cancer stage depends on blood levels of a protein called prostate-specific antigenic, 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 A-N-T-I-G-E-N. Okay. Higher levels of PSA call mean a higher stage of cancer. Tumor genetics. A tumor's gen genes and mutations influence cancer stage staging. When the body cells turn cancerous, their genes change rapidly and develop new traits. New traits. Now, diagnose. 
I'm not gonna really read all these, but it says imagine, imagine your chest, which is not to use imagine, imagine chest like text like MRI ultrasound to appear inside the body without cutting the open. Um, endoscope involves the doctor inserting a small tube or wire into the body to look at the organs with a small camera. It includes tests like the colonoscopy, the bronco, bronco oscopy, um, um, bronchoscope, okay, uh, biopsy, doing biopsy, the doctor picks a tissue sample of tumor, tumor when looked at under the microscope. Lab test. Doctors are learn to learn a lot of by testing your blood, other body fluids, and tissue samples. Recap. Treatment. Surgery is often the first line of defense against a tumor. Chemotherapy uses protein drugs to kill cancer cells. It can use other cancer symptoms. Chemo kills the body fast growing cells such as those that line the mouth or hair follicle that causes many side effects, including hair loss. Radiation therapy uses radiation to kill cancer cells. Radiation is energy that can damage cells, so doctors use it to weaken the cancer cells. Hormone therapy is also known as Endocrine therapy. It uses it. It used with tumors that need hormones to grow. Prostate and breast cancer are two examples by the David depriving the cancer cells of hormones. Targeted therapy is a form of personalized medicine. It attacks the cancer based on its genetics. These these can slow down. Slow or stop the growth of cancer cells by targeting the gene changes that led these cells grow out of control. Or let these cells grow out of control. An immune therapy uses the body immune system against cancer. It might be surprising, but the body was has ways to find and destroy cells that could become cancer. These theories, these therapies help support the body's immune system and it fights cancer. Okay, now you got breast cancer, which the doctors often treat they treat breast cancer with thermo thermo to shrink the tumor size before surgery. After surgery, radiation and hormones may be used to kill any cancer cells that are left. Colorectal cancer, the first move to stage three cancer is often surgery to remove cancer from the colon and lip note. Radiation may be used on the, on the, the part of the tumor they cannot completely remove. Melanoma, treated for stage three. Starts with surgery, doctors remove a wide area of skin and the lip nodes in the area. Immune and targeted can reduce the risk of the tumor coming back. Radiation and chemotherapy may follow if the lip nodes are heavily involved. Now, that's all I'm gonna speak about today because there's a whole lot on here. If you, if you uh, download or search uh, stage three counseling, it will give you a whole list of things. I just, you know, the surface, skim the surface of what I want to tell y'all about. So if you're new to the channel, like, subscribe, cut on post notifications so you never miss a video, comment down below and let me know what you think. So until next time, remember you're too blessed to be stressed, love and happiness at all times. Love someone and tell them that you love them, but tomorrow's not promised. And until next time, I'll see you then. <laughs>